was 10. Laver and Lendl shared that. Just the dominant force. Well, that's what David Dinko can do. He'll make you hit a lot of shots. Young American Isner and Lopez won the first set in that match. David Dinko trying to get off the blocks early. And has the first game. Try to hit as Nadal of the tournament this year. Well, the, the way the ranking system is in the men's and women's. On the board in the ace column. And see David Danko out there in the practice courts with his brother. We'll travel where he's not aiming. Them. He'll make those adjustments. And David Danko moves to 3 1. Beautiful. There's that movement again. He jumped on top of this. He saw that Federer gave him something short, something to go after. And then this one, too, he's right there in time and can smack it cross court for the winner himself. Wow. Oh, oh, good start is this. <laughs> he's the only top guy left in the four, four semifinals that didn't play any night matches. He's, so he's maybe more used to this daytime conditions and atmospheres. Incredible start. Oh my. Whisk in dusty conditions. Practice makes perfect. Well, he that's exactly right. He often practices. He has to because yes. Davidenko is sending a very strong message that he's at the top of his of his game. So he saves a so use that body as he springs out of that. Service position. Here's a fourth break point for the world's number. That's too daunting. To playing Feder Ash Court semis. This situation, this chance for him to take another historic step in the sport. I think of it is for David Day. Oh, yeah. It's three off. Way harder than he normally does. 126 and loses the point. Uh, it got spat back at him, and we saw Federer do that again. Movement is any other part of it. Andre Agassi has said time and again, Roger Federer most play.
to get the ball by Federer on the serve. He out aced Roddick the other night. I didn't think that would happen. Second ace. Straight sets over David Ferrer earlier. On serve, 3 4. Oh. Those angles he's able to create. Dime there to make sure he didn't hit the net. He sees that this ball may come back from Davidenko, so he moves in. You can really see the wind wreaking havoc with it. Moving it around, he's stuck with it. Trying to keep Roger off balance. There's a double for him. Donates the game. Mm -hmm. And it the opening game of the match. Now very much in control at 5 3. On the sideline. He was almost down a double break, and he's. Davidenko that will hit a two handed volley. This time, Federer hits a nice shot, keeps it low. Davidenko just reached. Father, there. What? Yeah, Federer barks at that one as he saves Breaker. He's gonna hit that inside out volley so it's spin away. Wow. You can see why he's been breaking his opponent's return service games. Second shot, but because he's so speedy, he can make her second shot a tough one. Look at that. The serve. It's what happens after that. Speed as a weapon. He doesn't have the huge. The Russian Olympic Committee would have to give him permission. It'll be interesting to see if they say yes to that. He's a top player. There's a terrific hold at love for five all. That would seem what in the world happened. Right? Big service winner to 30 love. That rich pace. It's so tough to tell where he's going to hit it. And he punctuates the game with an ace, his fifth. Roger Federer to a tie break to decide this first set. Seven games to five. Backhand Davidenko, he's got great eyes, blue eyes. Perhaps he should have taken a look at the corner away. This shows you what the wind, big swing on that forehand. It's complicates things here. Federer takes a look at the baseline. He thought the previous shot had gone easy. There. He had to be quick. He can 
take an excellent return that's pretty well angled and he moves forward and takes it early the most players Double fold and it's Federer to love up a set. He's got to make Federer earn these points. So Federer's got that too. He's incredibly relaxed as he moves around the court. Everything seems so easy for him. Roger Federer with up a set, three left in the second. Late afternoon sun in New York. 4.15 in the afternoon. Hope you'll be with us tonight, 8 o'clock, the women's final. So good at you know, pulling you off the court of the floor. He doesn't even need that shot. <laughs> How about that? Yeah, he <laughs> must have been stuck. listening. Both feet off the ground, just incredible. Oh. <laughs> Still got it. <laughs> Come on, Davidenko. And it started off this crazy angle off the return, and then it just kept getting worse and worse for Davidenko. Federer did what he loved to deuce. Davidenko scrambled well again. That first return, it looked like it hit both lines. Look at the muscles in the back of Federer. Watching Federer cut through all this wind and make his shots. This, but this one got him going. Again, this the net so tightly strung here on it. Davidenko with the big four. Well, Davidenko had made a couple on four stars this game, so Federer was content. Just dead. <laughs> what terrific parents you understand what. Uh, a grandson they produced. And hooked in the court. Davidenko thought this was going to go wide, but he saw the. Uh, His return game is so good. But he, uh, he needs to step in closer and hurt the fellow and more. Hit a bigger His mother, a South African, and one of his charitable causes involving helping. Very lovely woman. We're funny and. Quick and kind. He said it was his dad who was very demanding. He wasn't sure he could be a professional tennis player. Looking at this. This is what Davidenko likes to do: is take a bigger swing at the volley. You know, Mid-court shots. He, there's another play that he practiced. Take this game off, Federer. Show us open series coming in. Davidenko guesses right, hits a pretty good shot here. Federer's 
content to just hit good, solid deep. <laughs> It's a good start, but to hit an outright winner from that position is very difficult. Gives him a break point. Quickly blown away on the eighth ace, Vincent Van Gogh. Yes. Nine lifetime record against Federer. It's hard to be positive right now. 5 1 down in the second. 13 now. 14. 6 1 for the second set. Three time defending champion Roger Federer walking toward the finals. Final. Third set. And it opens with a guess what? Smith winner. He's talked about being fitter than ever. He takes a lot of pride in it. Defensive lob. Oh. And Davidenko working to take away final tomorrow, late afternoon, after NFL football. One all in the hours. Been planted on the entrance. Oh, you tricked me. Defensive there, and it didn't happen. Not much on that shot. David Dick. of what he's capable of. This is his fourth Grand Slam semi. The bitch has won in straight sets and now Roger Federer serving with a two set lead one two in the third against Nikolai Davidenko. He's made a nice little second effort here the Russian. And that's what it's like. This is not Chris. He's set. He's getting looks, David Denko. He's getting checked. One of only five sets, in fact, not including today's action. Yeah, from how early he took this shot. See, Federer is not in position up at net. How do you even get We're going to say he's Austrian? I'm not sure. I'm not sure I'm ready to do that. Austrian, Maybe he'll be the first guy to play Davis Cup for Russia and the Olympics for Austria. Meanwhile, Side of the court, he slipped. It's a good effort. Ow. And 
And there's the break for Federer. Back on serve. Three and another Federer service game. How did Federer get that? Well, he didn't get that. It's usually what you expect from Federer. And all of a sudden, Davidenko's got a break point again. And gets a second ball. Federer in the last game. And he gets it given to him as Federer double faults. Because Netsaba can call up the goods with the upset. Some pretty heavy ground. Finally, you see her serve, and you think that's not a good enough reason. Five, five and a half. Casually. In the one, one fifteens, one twenty range at times. It's as good as most guys. Championship where Novak Djokovic, the young 20 year old Serb, awaits, adding to the Michigan Wolverine miseries 32 to 7. College football scores. Davidenko. Yeah, Federer is in complete control at this point. And Davidenko guesses right and really puts up. But I can't let you get away with she serves as big as the guys because I got an avalanche of male players call me as we speak. Already? She can't. For her to be able to serve in the in the teens is pretty impressive stuff. And is there a guy her size who can even exist? You know. And here comes Nikolai Davidenko. <laughs> he gets it. Rocker's been broken three straight times. Oh, 
has really taken it to Federer here, trying to get this set. That is just so good. Put the ball a little bit sooner than Roger expected. Federer to the form, same set point. Unusual for the men's tour of a set like this. <laughs> Davideko expects, look at that. He didn't look like he was in a position, and out of nowhere, he just lifted the racket up and flicked it cross court. And it's such a difficult spot. Traditional looking running forehand. Extremely difficult, yes, to find this ankle, uh, angle, but you've seen other players do it. Great games. Davidenko oh. faces 15. Yeah. So Federer back in front. Another break. Serves for the final. 6 5 in the third. After breaking his opponent, Nikolai Davidenko. So Jeff Federer saying, enough's enough. Two big serves here. Miserable effort from that standpoint. Three big serves by Federer. And that'll do it. Roger Federer. Novak Djokovic will battle tomorrow. It wasn't always easy for the U.S.